Welcome back to the fight as Pokemon Vanguard. Oh god, I'm gonna sneeze. That's a great way to start. No, that. No, that. No, that. No, that. Oh, okay. In the last episode, we finished up the tournament, but after we beat Zeke, we apparently blacked out and fell asleep for 20 hours. Woke up in the hotel, found out Zeke lost to someone else, and then Zane won the whole thing. In this episode, we were assigned an assignment that to go to Forstein Cavern to help another trainer, which we're going to do right now. Okay, we don't want to go that way. Really, really do I? Not cool. Ah, here we go. Got some more candies. Nice. More potions. Cool. Great balls. Even better. Ooh, that's done. That can't be bad. Yo, gummy. Yum, yum. One trainer. Hello. Iris. Yep, that's me. Didn't think we'll be seeing each other so soon again. I'm facing the wrong way. I assume you're the one that put in the request for us to assist you with your assignment. Well, I really wouldn't say assist. My mentor suggests I take you two along with me and let you experience real trainer work. Your mentor? Isaac, the Grandmaster Ranking Trainer. So I guess my father does give a damn about me that. Not sure what you mean by that, but he talks about you. Don't want to hear it. Let's just get this over with. So wait, you aren't part of an academy anymore? But instead you're working for someone? Once you reach the ranking of gold, you're allowed to become an apprentice of a professional trainer. Once yourself become a professional trainer, you can still work under the same people. I've been working under Zika ever since I became a gold ranking trainer about three years ago. You're still a gold trainer after three years. Well, no, I got my platinum rank a year after. Judging from how you two battle, it amazes me that you're only both bronze trainers. Your strength really is something. Oh, thanks. Whatever. Can we just get on with the assignment? Probably just says something of a possible renegade. Is that true? Have you ever heard of the cult of Isaiah? I haven't. It doesn't ring a bell. All right then. Story time. Oh, for the Christ. I don't know much of it myself, but I'll explain what I can. A thousand years ago, Pokemon were not our allies, but enemies of humanity. They ruled the world, forced us to hide on the ground to survive. But one day, a name man named Isaiah trained one of these creatures and became the world's first Pokemon trainer. He taught his methods to many others, and together humanity took back our world. Now, present day, there are groups who still worship Isaiah, some peacefully, some not. The Cult of Isaiah is a group of extremists who believe humans have taken far too much advantage of Pokemon and no longer view them as allies, rather slaves. I consider it a righteous cause if it weren't for the fact that they recently robbed the Pokemon storage facility. Alright, so where do we start? I want you two to meet me on Route 5. I heard reports of someone wearing one of the uniforms going in and out of an abandoned factory. Do whatever you need to prepare. I'll meet you both outside. Give me one sec, guys. Thank you. 
Alright, the factory is just up ahead. I'm going to make my way ahead of you both and ensure there isn't danger up ahead. But don't fall too far behind me. See if there's any cool encounters. There's two we have not seen yet. My repel on. gonna try to catch him. You have Pokeball. Don't mind if I do. Lombre! That is damage. Okay, so we have a bug trainer here. Let's go to Growlithe. Well, that sounds like you problem, but not me. So I saw one shroomish and now I'm not seeing any more. Really? Right, then we'll just pop our repel back on. That's a little cool chilling there. Oh, that is a polyrath. It appears there are some people up ahead. They're all wearing serum or closer, so if I had to guess, Renegades? Seems like it. Great, let's get in there and whoop their asses. Not so fast. We don't know exactly the level of the situation here. One Renegade could turn into a few. A few could turn into many. It's also possible the factory up ahead is a base of operation, rather than just a hiding place. 
We might have bit off more than we can chew. So what do we do? Hmm. Zeke. Hmm? I want you to go to the nearest town and contact the trainer association. I'll lend you my access code, which will allow you to do so. What the hell are you two going to do then? You didn't let me finish. I need your question available on a nearby high-ranking trainer to assist us with this operation. Farrah and I will try and keep an eye on them, just in case they decide to pack up and leave for whatever reason. Take this as a direct order from a superior. Psst, whatever, I'll get it done. Zeke's changed quite a bit since I last saw him. He is incredibly stubborn, but he gets the job done. And from the battle I shared with him in Torment, our strengths seem to be on par. Well, that's good to hear. So how are we going to go to go about this? I'm going to do a little bit of investigation and try and see how close I can get without being spotted. I want you to explore up north a bit to see if you can find anything too. But under no circumstances should you engage combat with any renegades you spot unless you're absolutely forced to. Got it? Yeah, I'll check out north. Ludicolo, Ludicoli, Ludicolo. Oop, excuse me. There. That's a trainer. Actually, let's talk to Iris real quick. Oh, fire. Do you need some extra supplies? Hey, got some great balls. Let's go. Some super potions. I will happily take those. Some mini revives. Cool. And some candies. Nice. You should be able to put those to good use. Anyway, I'll be waiting here. So let me know if you find anything interesting. Really, Lily Polo? Can't escape. Great. Got the poison. That's huge. You missed. Let's go. And he missed again, even better. That poison pretty much saved us, probably. Strong enough to proceed through Route 5? I think so. Radicate. Oh, you're right, okay, it just goes bye bye. Let's 
does some decent damage. Did you really have to crit me, my dude? Was that crit really necessary? I don't think that threat was necessary. One mod that could counter his uh, thingamajig is fainted. Good damage, though. And he didn't poison me, thankfully, which I do appreciate. Goodbye. battle you my dude hey more candies at all oh just candies in there what else is honestly big mushroom nice money yeah that's just a polyrath not chancing it whatsoever Type it is. What do we got? Nine. Woo! Yes. 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 Yes.
They got hound dogs though. Oh god. Good damage. Shadow punch again. Finish him. Wow, that did not finish him. That should. Hi. Damn, I really can't get caught like that. I gotta be more careful. Okay, so we don't want to go directly to him. Aha! Over here. I see. I see. Do the IV changing. Okay, so it was just two guys. Hold up. Honestly, this area might be better for spine things because ow. I just bashed my knee on my desk. That really hurt. Good fine part. I guess all we gotta do is sit here and wait. Yep. So far, how long have you been attending the academy for? Only about a month and a half. And you already at this strength? That's pretty crazy. You and Zeke are way ahead of your peers already. I mean, I assume Zeke must have had a few years of prior training because of his father, but skills like yours doesn't come out of nowhere, you know? If you don't mind me asking, what kind of training or mentoring did you receive before you came to the academy? Uh, well, I... I also just studied Pokemon battles with Destiny. Well, seems like it clicked more with you than her. No offense to Destiny, of course. I guess. Someone's coming. Oh, Lady Vivian. Is he inside? Yes, he is waiting for you. Good. I'll step aside. Who's that? Change of plans, Fire. 
I'm going in after them. Oh, wait. Weren't you the one who said we should wait for Zeke and the others? I did, but I changed my mind. That woman, I have to go after her. Look, I know you're a strong trainer, but are you sure you can handle this? What happens if there are a ton of enemies in there? What happens if help doesn't get here in time to help you? Taking risks is a big part of being a trainer. But the real struggle is having to be the one that decides. The one who has to take the fall. If the gamble doesn't end in their favor. Trust me, Fire. I can do this. Oh boy. Another one. Quickly. Notify Lady Vivian. Right. Member of the Trainer Association. Pathetic. The Court of Isaiah will punish you for your sins. How are you, bastard? Taking the rest of the butter for But apparently it was a good move. I wasn't strong enough. Where's Iris and Vivian? V you're after Vivian. <laughs> no mediocre trainer such as yourself will stand cha any chance against Vivian. I mean, a bad Pokemon, but I'll enjoy as he crushes yours. Hey, some Pokeballs, let's go. Let's heal up real quick. That was my last burn here. That's unfortunate. Alright, let's go. Say, great balls, let's go. You can't eat that. Ripple. Nice. My ball. Cool, cool, cool. Okay. So I gotta be a little more careful. You will fall here and now. We'll see. Growlithe. Of course your Growlithe has intimidate while it not just a decent chunk. This is gonna hurt though. Ow. Haunter. But if we're our Growlithe. Ouch. Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh, 
Really? Let's go. Oh, so close. This is probably going to be a long video. I'm sure plenty of you are like, Fire, why are you keeping Butterfree on the team? He's good, but he's not great. I'm like, yeah, but I need a strong electric type before, um... Until a swab will evolve, it's like... You gotta have some power. We'll see. Beautiful. Beautiful like dies. Those dogs will stay in. Shut up, punch. Wow, he lit that. Jesus. Go swabble. Don't get me wrong, Swablu is a great type of electric dragon. Like, that's like one of the greater typings you can get, I feel like. Hey, a key! Found a key, found a key! I got the key! I probably destroyed all your earbuds with that. I, Vivian, stronger than all of us. I will be the judge of that. Swallow. Ooh, that's actually not good for me. Butterfree. I mean, that did a lot, too, thankfully. I don't my suit for that. You went through! For who? Okay. You went through again. The dissociation. Let's go. Luxio. Electric fighting, I believe, right? Ralph <coughs> would be great for this, but, you know. And 
would you freaking paralyze me? Come on! Some more Pokeballs can't complain. Nothing. Well, that's disappointing. I think that's it. Let's sorry, Gralis. Relith and Swallow Blue are probably my weakest team members right now. Oh, I need another key. Is that Sue? This is going to be a long battle. Once we get that. That is what I was aiming for. Oh. 
how did Deerling survive that? That's what I want to know. Got a lot of sweethearts, so I might as well use them. You dare oppose the cult of Isaiah? I do. I do dare. Oh, hey, did you? That's actually huge. So he did 31. As long as she doesn't crit. Let's go! Let's go take on potentially Vivian. <sighs> I can't wait to be able to get to the point where we have regular revives, not mini revives. I mean, that will be great. Let's go. Protectors of this region? How pathetic. Ugh. Iris! Fire, get. Ah. Another one? Fire, run. This woman is obviously incredibly strong. But, Iris, you can't just leave them here. Who are you? Someone way more important than you'll ever imagine. You can never fat. I don't care what the hell you are. Well, I really wonder. Will your courage hold up in battle? Fire, you. I have to try. Because if I don't, who knows what will happen to Iris? Zeke should arrive here soon with Batman. All you need to do is hold out until then. So what will it be? Just bring it on. Take a left, go down. Nine tails. Got the whistle. He's got the whistle. And nine tails goes down just like that. Let's go. This music sick. For you. That did nothing.
episode gone bulky. Very bulky. Oh, I'm dead. No, I'm not. <laughs> I was mistaken there. Let's go! I feel like Bronzer can't take out a combusket. I hope I'm not mistaken with that statement, though. Future site. Alright, we're definitely switching out after we take it out. Let's go. That's fine, I'm not a physical attacker, my dude. Kalyon. That is not good. I live on three. That is nuts. I can just stall him out, honestly. Which is exactly what I'm gonna do. See ya! Impossible. I beat her. Brought all my Pokemon. I just have to pray that she doesn't have some sort of trick up her sleeve. I was ignorant. To think I would have to rely on Pokemon to prevail. Fire, was it? Huh? You have earned my respect. But unfortunately, I can't let you or your friend leave here alive. What? It was nice meeting you, Fire. Wait! Where? All I can see is white. No. Who? It can't be. Hello? Wait, why won't, why won't my mouth move? Has everything I've done been for nothing? This voice. Wait, Vivi? Does anything really matter? 
Am I supposed to go on, knowing that everything I've done so far means nothing? Vivi, please, can you hear me? It's all hopeless. No. I have to keep moving. Everyone that has gotten me this far, I can't let it be for nothing. And I know that even you wouldn't let me down. You'd be there for me. Maybe. So let's... Let's finish this. Archon Gauntlet. Level cap 30. Fire. Ugh. Fire! Destiny! Wait. What happened? You don't remember. Zeke and another tra trainer found you and Iris inside the factory. They said they saw an explosion of light, but once they got inside, it didn't look like any recent damage had been done. I swear if I had any a nickel for every time I was there for you to wake up from fainting, I'd have three nickels, <laughs> which isn't a lot, but it's kind of weird that it happened three times. What about Iris? Is he alright? Just a twisted ankle. Keith said he should be healed in about a week. That's good. Did we manage to catch any of the renegades? Crap. I really failed. Fire, don't beat yourself up about it. I'm sure you did everything you could. Maybe. Thanks, Destiny. You know, it's kind of funny. Over the last few weeks, I've gotten phone calls from my mom going crazy about how I've gotten hurt during these insane things. But since Keith marked her as your emergency contact, it's really just been about you. I'm not really sure why it is entirely, but she cares a lot about you. Excuse me, may I enter? Oh, sure. Fire, then you must be Destiny. Oh yeah, that's me. My name is Nastasha. I was a trainer sent to assist Zeke. Fortunately, we weren't able to arrive on time to prevent all the events that occurred. Anyway, I would like to speak with Fire privately, if you don't mind. Oh, no problem. Fire, feel better, Fire. He likes us. The trainer associate wanted me to discuss a few things with you. Oh, it's about Vivi, and while well, you're... Continuous encounters with renegades. Continuous encounters? Wait, now that I think about it, I've had four encounters with renegades. The average student rarely has an encounter with any type of renegade before joining an institution when they reach gold rank. Yet you've encountered them four times, despite being a trainer for less than two months. Is there anything you can make of this? No. Sorry. So you're telling me it's just a coincidence? Yes. That's the only answer I can give you. I'm sorry. I guess that's all then. Anyway, I'll inform Keith of your status and then be on my way. I look forward to working with you in a future fire. Normal weeks. Right. I am very happy to say that I am incredibly satisfied with your recent work. All five of you have definitely proven to meet the standards of the next rank. Wait, are we getting promoted? Yep. For a promotion isn't just something I can hand to you all. For your last promotion exam, I had you battle trainers on a level that you were attempting to reach, but this time, things will be much more challenging. I want to explain more, but I feel like I should wait until you reach the destination of the exam before doing so. When you are ready, head to Route 1 and proceed north until you find me. Understood? Mm-hmm. Yep. Sure. Let's get on with it. Alright. I think that's a good spot to wrap up this episode. In the next episode, we are going to head to Route 1. And then, go all the way north. Thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this extra long video. Feel free to smash that like button, hit subscribe, and feel free to leave any comments in the comment section. With that being all said, I'll see you guys in the next episode!